Good afternoon, traders. It is Wednesday, October 20th, 2021, and the U.S. stock market is closed. Uh, looking at the Dow chart here, uh, this is kind of interesting. Uh, but I told you yesterday we were one day away from making uh, all-time record highs, and you see right here, a Dow opens up and has this, a push uh, higher here. By the way, this push was very slow. It was like it was in slow motion. But right about there, on the top of this first hump, uh, that was where the Dow actually hit its previous all-time record high. And then not surprisingly backed off of that for about an hour and then it tried another run at it and it broke it and this top of this second hump represents all-time record intraday highs for the Dow Jones Industrial Average and that was about midday and then it just slowly backed off some and ended up closing just below the previous record closed. So what we had today is new intraday record highs on the Dow, but we did not have a record close. And again, you heard me complain about this. Uh, you know, I would expect that we would have a good day to day, particularly since we had all winners on the close yesterday. You'd expect this kind of open would make for more profits than we had on the close yesterday. No, that's not the way the the Biden bull market works. Uh, we had fourteen thousand dollars on the close yesterday with all winners on six s stocks we had coming in and by the time we close that out we close that out with 8600 so we saw a drop of between five and six thousand dollars on our open trade even though the rest of the market was moving higher uh, again very frustrating but it gets worse. We got into eight new positions today. None of them closed positively. Eight of them closed negatively. And we're carrying negative $13,000 plus going into tomorrow. Now my pro suite charts don't show this. But uh, my... Uh, trade station uh, 9.5 version is what I trade uh, they show losers in red and winners in green and I just find it very curious that yesterday on the close I had solid green screens uh, for all these positions and others every position we had yesterday on the close was a winner and today on the close all eight positions that we have is is red so we went from solid green yesterday to solid red today and that happens on the day the dow jones industrial average made uh, all-time record intraday highs just pretty unbelievably by the way if i didn't mention the dow officially closed up 152 points today i'm going to show you just one stock um that uh, this was a a profitable trade no doubt about it but it illustrates the the you know the frustrating kinds of stuff that keeps happening to us in uh, these Biden markets. And uh, on yesterday, 
we had this big, this is CEI, which is Camber Energy. By the way, this, is, this has been our most spectacular stock. Uh, it's made, a, you know, in the... It's made like $78,000 in the past few weeks. It's just been really great. And it made money today, no question about it. Yesterday we had this big uh, run up uh, 45 minutes into the day. We got in here and it closed profitably. And then it gapped up big time this morning. And on top of here, on top of this first bar this thing was up uh, to twelve thousand three hundred dollars but the whack-a-moles weren't gonna let us get away with that and they just jumped on this thing and pushed it down to here where we got out and where we got out was with seventy eight hundred so we basically saw the gave up forty five hundred dollars to the whack-a-moles in the first thirty to forty minutes of the day and it, you know this is going to happen i'm used to this happening sometimes but now it just happens all the time it, it's just like there's no such thing where uh the the stock opens up and then starts um forcing short short covering up here and moving higher so we end up on this 30 to 45 minute wait we end up getting out with more profits now it just always seems like they got to push it down and eliminate um, a significant percentage of those profits that's just driving me crazy i mean it it's driving me crazy but overall you know we had a losing day but it wasn't a bad losing day but boy i wish it would stop doing this anyway that's the way it went Terry bob sign i'll see you tomorrow on thursday